In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create this logo and this logo can be used for your school or for academy or for private tuitions, etc. As you can see here, I have used this kind of a colorful book and then you can uh, write your institution name here at the bottom and if you have some uh, logo slogan also you can add it. Likewise, I have created one more slide with the darker theme. So depending on your requirement, you can choose the slide from. And if you have not subscribed to my channel PowerPoint University, please subscribe it now and make sure to enable the bell notification icon. You can join my telegram group with the help of this link and if you like to contribute to my channel, you can do it through PayPal or Patreon. The link is provided in the video description section. So let's start the tutorial. Add a new slide, go to view, enable the guides, go to insert shapes. From the rectangles, I'm going to choose this rectangle shape, a draw or rectangle shape, maybe this much size. Later on, we can increase or decrease, not a problem with that. And shape outline, make it no outline, align center, align middle. Then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to add a few more shapes here. For that, go to insert shapes. And from the basic shapes, I'm going to choose this right triangle draw the right triangle you can see something like this shape outline no outline and rotate i'm just going to make it flip horizontal and hold the control shift key bring it down something like this and give some different color okay let me just put it here it looks something like this can you see here so now what i'm going to do is the one which i've added here this one i'm going to add it and this one i'm going to subtract it okay and this one for the time being i'll just keep it somewhere here for the later use so let me just select this shape hold the shift key select this one merge shape make it union select this shape merge shape and subtract it and make sure that there's no outline here all right so once this is done i'm just going to put it here okay you can put it exactly in the center and shape fill I'm going to choose this color here. Can you see like this color combination or any color combination you can choose. Now I'm going to duplicate this by pressing Ctrl D and then for this I'm going to give this color, put it exactly in the center and increase the size. You can see here like this and send this to back. And if you want to do uh, more at the bottom, right mouse click, edit point and you can just simply drag this point here okay so it looks something like this all right you can see here again if you want some uh, more gap you can give and then i'm going to select this one and i'm going to give this color pink bring it here exactly put it and just increase the size and send this to back so you can see here the one side is over now i'm just going to select this one press ctrl d to duplicate and shape fill i'm going to give this color and here i'm just going to rotate it you can see here flip vertical and put it here like this i'm going to select this one press ctrl d and then i'm going to give the color which is uh, this one the teal color bring it here again flip vertical all right and then send this to back now this is not the one which i want so you have to just Make sure that this is the right combination we have selected. Okay. You can see here still we need to select one more time. Okay. Flip vertical and put it here. And then this one press Ctrl D and I'm going to choose this color blue and exactly align it and send this to back. So you can see here the logo is ready and again if you feel that you need to do some more changes you right mouse click edit point and you can just reduce the size you can see here something like this again right mouse click edit points and you can just reduce the size okay so once this is over you can select all the shapes press ctrl g to group it and then again you want to increase the height decrease the height or whatever you can put it and put it exactly in the center and then your logo is ready and then below you can add the school name okay i'll just say school logo center align any color of your choice you can choose it i'm going to choose a font called oswald or any other font and increase the size 
all right so you can see here it looks like this again if you want some darker shade you can same color i'm just going to put in the background like this and again if you want some shadow effect also you can add some shadow effect here